Good morning. It is Tuesday and the storms have passed. Pretty much. <laughs> I see some clouds coming from the south, but I think we're done. And I have work to do, and I'm going to do just a little quick project that I wanted to share with you. And it is involving my solar panels. And so let's get started. So this is my solar generator. And the first thing I have to do is come in here. Oh, first, let's turn it off. And then I got to disconnect that wire. Okay, so it took both hands. <laughs> now we have to go outside and do some work on the panels. Every day brings new light to help us on our way. Always taking my breath, whether sun or rain. The wind will carry us over that horizon we see. Drop that cinder block on my solar panel. That was done. Ah. Okay. These panels are my old panels, and that's what I've had connected. And I think it's the angle that I need. So um, I'm going to make these a better angle. Disconnect these. MC four connectors. Sometimes they're hard, difficult to get apart. <sighs> struggle, struggle. My hands are just not strong enough. Come up. It 
it's not moving at all. Supposed to be simple. It's got little holy clips. That you push down. But they are not moving at all. Please come apart. <sighs> These are my old panels. They're Renogy. And my in my my generator is an energy generator. And so it has its own special wiring. And so it's just going to make it hard on me. I don't know what I'm going to do. I might need to get a tool. What tool is the question? I can't. They're just not moving at all. Please let go. <sighs> <sighs> okay, let's try this. We did it. Oh, we did it. Oh. into oh okay so that's done now i do have to secure this to these cinder blocks well i'm out of breath <laughs> y'all hear me huffing and puffing i think see here's what it, let's see let's see what it looks like and I did that because I, I wasn't getting all the power I thought I should. And before I try to replace the panels, which is basically what I did. I brought over my old panels, but those panels are five years old. So they're not as efficient as a new panel. These two panels came, I bought those especially for the generator. So, and... Boy, did they get muddy in the storm, so I'm going to have to wash them off. But I'm going to go in, plug in, and see how we're doing. Okay. We're plugged in, and we're going to turn it on. Oh, there it comes. There, that's what I needed to know. Oh, yeah, baby, I'm charging. And 9 o'clock in the morning, and... I'm getting about the same as I did on the other panels. So something is not right. I should be getting close to 200 watts of solar at some point. So I'll just keep an eye on it today and see what's happening. 
it is humid this morning at uh, around 6 a.m. It was 66 degrees and the humidity was 86 percent. I expect that to dissipate as the day goes on. But right now, the sun has just started shining down because all of the remnant of the storm was passing by when I got up this morning. So I did not finish my shawl blanket. So I am on the last rose. And I did time myself. It would take me, it took me an hour to make one row. <laughs> so it's going to take me the rest of the day <laughs> to get that done. But it looks like I'm getting a really good charge, even with dirty panels. So I am very excited about that. And so that was a success. Now, the next part of this project, not today and not at this moment, I do not believe. I will take the other two panels back to the tiny and then I'll plug them in over there. So two things coming up. Y'all stay tuned, and I will see you on Monday. I love y'all. Trouble comes and it will 